Let's see, are we back? Maybe we're back, hopefully we're back. Are we back? Do, 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 do. Hello? Hello, hello, hello. Testing, testing. Testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. Testing, testing, testing one, two, three. Testing, one, okay, yeah, testing. looks like we are back. Sorry about that, guys. For whatever reason, I dropped, uh, my phone dropped the stream, so. Anyway, whatever. Uh, one thing I did forget to do, I could share that I'm live here on Twitter really quick. Okay. Tweeter. Da -da 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 -da. I guess I should have done this in between uh, <laughs> noticing that it dropped, but uh, it's all good. We'll just share real quick and head back to the time. Dee dee doo 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 da 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 da. Ba 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 ba. Alright, tweet, and let's head back over here. Close that out. Okay. Alright, back to the duels. Yeah, and we lost that duel versus Don there. I just finished it out, you know, in case we had any rewards for the dailies or gyms. Alright, yeah. And that's that's why I usually check the stream every now and then, because uh, yeah, you never know when like someone's gonna chat or you might uh, drop stream. So anyway, I noticed pretty quickly this time, so that's good. Uh, let's see what rewards we get. Oh, nice, got a hundred. Yeah, man, a lot of uh, gems in this event. Okay, we only special summoned once there. Right, right. We were born his majestic dragon, and I flubbed it up. All right, let's see. Huh. Actually, let me check the effect of uh, Majestic Dragon. I'm just really curious uh, if that last effect I did was optional or not. That way, if I ever steal it again, I know I know how to menu correctly. Let's see. Let's put in... Because it was a Majestic Star Dragon, right? Yeah, and I messed it up. So, Majestic Star. Majestic Star Dragon. This one, right? No, no, no. It was this one yeah 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 this one right or was it this one oh no they're the same let's check it out during the end phase target one stardust in your graveyard return oh okay 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 wait is this mandatory uh is this optional or mandatory once per turn you can negate right i did this part negate its effects to the end of the turn and you Oh, maybe that's why I did it. Yeah, because I used the negate. Uh, did it automatically prompt the in phase stuff? Maybe that's why. Or is this. The way this reads, it seems like this is mandatory. Yeah, during the in phase, target the Stardust from your graveyard. Return this from the field to the extra deck. Huh. Yeah, if I'm reading that right, uh, Majestic Star Dragon only stays out for one turn. That's weird. It's not how I remember that card working, but, uh... Okay. If you say so, Master Duel. Uh, let's see. What's going on here? Okay, let's get back to the championship. World Championship 2023. Alright, we're still gonna roll with Venoms. Let's do it. Let's do it. Man, that, that was crazy. We actually had full combo there. Uh, we had Viper's Rebirth, but then again, we don't really want Venomenon in hand for full combo either. <laughs> and we also don't want a uh, low count of Reptiles in the graveyard, so... We were close, though. If I ever do get the chance, I will summon Venomenaga at least once in this... In this, uh, stream. Just for the fans, man. You gotta do it for the fans. Because that's, like, the whole point of the deck, anyway. Uh, let's see... Man, we, drew, we only have one of this, and we drew it. That sucks. Alright, alright. Let's see what you got, Goku. Oh, I get it, like Goku. But, uh... Are you saying Goku's the goat? War rocks. What? Uh, you can pay 800. Your battling monster gains a... Oh, I see, I see. That's... So basically, we have to get 2,600, at least. Uh, Interest. What is that? Oh. 
Well, that sucks. Well, then again, that could have been a lot worse. Um, so we need to get at least up to... How much? Well, no, there's another way we could do this. Let's go with Ogdoatic Water Lily. Change this back to on here. Show me that ash. Ash catch him enjoy us misty spring. Uh, that's not ash. Neither player can banish cards. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that works for me because I hate having my cards banished. Uh, let's go with... Stealth Burster. Because we got Ammonite in hand. Oh yeah. Stealth Burster effects. Ooh, maybe I should go into Golgar here, actually. So, let's place the counters. If this card is sent to the Monster Zone by an opponent's card effects... Oh, you can special summon from your deck? Oh, so we don't want to destroy it by card effect. Okay, glad I read that. Uh, Ammonite. Activate Ammonite. Uh-huh. Resurrect Stealth Burster. Okay, attack mode. Uh-huh. Okay, now we go into... We'll just destroy this by... So if I destroy it by battle, what happens? Uh... Nothing, apparently. Okay, I can, uh... So we'll overlay... Well, actually... Uh, something I just thought of. I could go into Shock Trooper as well. No, we'll go with Kidna. That way we'll go to Extra Search. Feel the Reptilian! Echidna. Do, 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 do. And we've done three summons so far. I definitely need to keep track. Definitely want to stay out of Nibir Nibiru range right here. Alright, lower it down to zero. Use the effect of Echidna. Ba, ba, na, na. And we have normal summons, so let's take... Let's take a uh, good old Kotal. Yes, yes, yes. Kotal! Alright, special summon Kotal. So, the, wait, this is our fourth summon, yeah? Because I did... Ammonite... Well, we are in range of getting Nibiru, but if we do, it's actually okay, because we've got Rebolon the Monster. Alright, Echidna and Kotal. We got full combo here, boys and girls. In fact, if he doesn't Nibiru this, then I'll, I'll just keep going, bro. I'll just keep going. That's a big slicer. Zero on. Yeah. And we get the effect now. Do, do, do. So we get a card that places uh, stuff. So let's actually take Code A, Ancient Ruins. Uh huh. And he's got two A counters on him, so here we go, Code A. A. Ba -da 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 -da. So with the Code A, we can actually. <laughs> let's just keep going here. Let's keep going. Because with code A, we can remove two counters. Take back Stealth Burster. Uh-huh. Because he's not using Nibiru, so... Why not? Full combo. Alright. She's so safe. With Reborn the monster, I will special summon a new monster. Ooh, or I could go into the Reptilian Synchro. No, 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 we've got full combo for Golgar, so let's do it. She's a so safe. The alien ammonite. Alrighty, and now we will... Synchro... What's going on? Okay, okay. Synchro summon Cosmic Fortress Golgar. Alright. We'll put Golgar way over here, one of the safest zones. Alright, Cosmic Fortress, Gilgar. Feel Synchro Shokan. Golgar. There we go. Alright, and we'll use Golgar's effect to place the counters on the monsters. So I'll bounce. Iron Wall. 
Uh, select another card. Yay! Ancient Ruins. And we'll place two counters here on Golgar. Doesn't this also re reset code A? If so, we're like popping off big time. Let's see. Oh my god, it does. Dude. Winning. Alright, let's take back Stealth Burster again for the third time in this turn. That's awesome, dude. We got, like, this is definitely full combo, bro. Alright. Attack mode, Stealth Burster. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Alright, we'll finally set Mass Hypnosis here. I mean, I could still keep going and comboing, uh, but, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't want to downgrade into Stealth Burster, so let's just attack here. Alright, so this gains only attack, so let's just attack with uh, zero all. Get in there, buddy. Do, 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 do. Alright, what you got, Goat Ku? <laughs> Goku is the goat. Mm hmm. See ya, buddy. And he should not get his effects. Yeah, because we just read about battle. Yay! Stealth Rusher. And Golgar, get in there, buddy. That was a pretty productive turn for us. That's like one of the best turns we could have ever hoped for with this deck. That was awesome. All right, all right. I definitely hope we, we got that all on stream. All right, but I'll check stream after this duel's over. Do do do, because it did kick out for whatever reason, so. Man, this music goes hard, bro. What you got, goat coo? Really, just one lightning storm would wreck me. <laughs> Uh, even if he wrecks the back row, that kind of does mess with my plans here. Or a Raigeki, you know. We'll see what he's got. Raigeki would be really bad. He's thinking. He's thinking. He's thinking. It'd be really perfect if we had, uh, instead of a Namanaga, if we also had, a. Uh, uh, what is it? The, uh... Yeah, that's... That kind of sucks. But, uh... Yeah, we lost Mass Hypnosis there. And, uh, Kode. Alright, well, he has the Duster. Does he have the Geki, too? Uh, but, yeah, if we would have had Planet Pollutant Virus there, instead of, uh, Venomanaga, man, that, this would have been perfect. Let's see... And also, hopefully he doesn't have Sphere Mode. I just thought of that. Yeah, Wing Dragon of Raw Sphere Mode would be... I would cry. Not literally, but, you know. Goku is thinking over there, man. The Ilt's Veil. Uh-oh. That's not good. Get to add whatever you archetype card you want. Um... From your hand... Oh... I see. If your warrior monster would be destroyed by a battle, you can send this card to the graveyard instead. Ah, I see. Well, we definitely want to bounce out with Golgar. Okay, well, we know the, the other card in his hand is uh, Imperial Iron Wall, and now he's going to search for one card. So there's only going to be one card in his hand that we don't know about. And he's taking a long time, though. Hopefully he'll time out. Uh, or maybe he's just thinking, like, how do I break, you know, one of these? I mean, War Rocks can do it, though. War, Rock, War Rocks can... Pretty sure I've seen some of, like, 2700 attack. They all have good battle phase effects, so... This shouldn't be too tough of a decision. Goat Coup? Well, I feel a little better, though, because he didn't follow that duster up with Bright Oh, he did timeout, yeah. Timeout win? Surrendered. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, I thought he'd timeout, because he just... He wasn't doing jack there, man. 
All right. Well, we definitely popped off in that door. Ooh, we leveled up. Nice, we're level seven now. Up to level seven with Venoms. Oh, three 2022, uh, 2023 special reward tickets. I have no ideas what those do. Maybe we should head to the shop. Because, yeah, I really have no ideas what they what that does. There may be a special pack, though. So, let's head here. Um, bonus pack. Ah, yes. Okay, okay. So at five, you can open five packs. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. I figured that's what it would be because it's just like, what? All right, let's check out if we did a daily. Do, 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 uh, if my, are we frozen? There we go. It was stuck there for a second. Come on, Master Duel. All right. Oh, so we get the daily of uh, Special Summon 5, and we activated a spell trap. Yeah, we activated Monster Reborn, so. Activated 30, so we get another 80 gems. Uh, I should, uh, while I'm thinking about it, I should make sure stream is still going, though. Because for some reason it did kick out just a minute ago, so. Whoops. Let's see. Right here. Uh, hello? Ought to be still alive. Do, 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 do. Let's see if we see that same symbol. As long as I can see stream, I'm cool with that. And I guess I'll test the audio too, yeah. I didn't think about that. See that same symbol. As long as I can see stream, I'm cool with that. Okay. And I guess I'll test the audio too, yeah. Everything sounds good, I think. As long as I can see stream, I'm cool with that. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I think we're good. And I tweeted it out, so we're good. All right. Back to dueling. All right. We didn't kick out that time. Good. That means we got that whole. Oops. Uh, retry. What's going on here, Master Duel? Don't tell me we're gonna have technical issues all day now. Do 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 do. There we go. Okay. Back to the duels. Uh, and how long was that first part? About 20 minutes? Okay, because I only plan to go for about two hours today, so. Alright, more world championship. Here we go. Yeah, what was weird is, well, I guess uh, I was streaming kind of late last night. I streamed last night around like midnight or so. Um, From like midnight to about two or three o'clock in the morning. Uh, and Man, stream didn't kick out once. I mean, my phone, uh, basically, based on the same setup I have now, yeah, my phone kept going for, like, yeah, the whole two and a half hours, and, you know, we made some good progress in that stream, so. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised it kicked out at all today, but then again, it is, we are right around, like, peak internet hours, uh, because it's, uh, well, as you guys can see, it's around close to four o'clock here. Anywhere from, you know, uh, school that's out here, uh, kind of at various intervals, like it. Uh, they stagger it. So one school lets out at like 255, then uh, 320, and then uh, 340. So a lot of people are getting out of school and off work. So Labyrinth, hmm, I don't really have too much good spell and trap removal. So we're in for an uphill battle. Hmm. Well, I do have Lightning Storm, though. The odds of me drawing it here are. I don't know. Ah. Uh, well, wish me luck, boys and girls. Lightning Storm. No. Kotal is good, though. Kotal is very good. Um, in fact, I might go for Kotal, because a lot of the Labyrinth effects pop cards. Uh, let's go for... Let me think here. Let's play... Let's try to bait the Ash. Let's play Water Lily. First turn. No Ash. Okay, he has only one card in hand, though, so, you know. Maybe it's Max C? Okay. So, let's do Kotal. I mean, Nunu. <laughs> no, I planned to special summon Kotal, though. Okay. Nunu. 
uh, normal summon Nauya. Get another water lily from the deck if we can. While we can, while we're not getting negated. Okay, nice. Well, so far so good. He's thinking. Okay. Now I could go into King of the Feral Imps. Um, maybe I should actually. No, because they have a uh, what you call it face down. Welcome Labyrinth. So I should definitely uh, try to go into the Reptilian Synchro ASAP. So, in fact, I don't even know why I played Nunu this turn. Oh, to bait Ash. Right, right, right. To bait Ash. So let's go for this. Yeah. Melusine. Okay. And hopefully they don't play Compulse. Some, uh, some Labyrinth decks do play Compulse just because it is a pretty easy uh, normal trap. But yeah, hopefully not. That would really suck. But, uh... Reptilian. Melusine. Okay. Okay, what is that? Okay, right, right. We knew they had this. The good news is our summon didn't get negated either, so... Now this is going to destroy a card in my hand, yeah? Hmm. Okay. Oh! <laughs> Whoops, I guess you can't read. They tried to destroy it. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Right. Yeah, in your opponent's hand at random. Okay, so we want to set our whole hand here, believe it or not. Now, does this have a monster effect when I attack? Uh, no. Okay, okay. We're good. Let's end the turn there. Rikasa. That's a cool name. Alright. Yeah, this is the main play of the deck. Let lovely Lady of the... Lovely Labyrinth of the Silver Castle. But whenever you're playing this deck, get rid of the field spell, uh, if at all possible. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So they're gonna replay Labyrinth. Well, I guess I can. Ooh, if I play Solemn Strike, um, can this be destroyed by card effects? Hang on, I need to know. Uh, I activate Solemn Strike. Tee <laughs> Yeah, you're not getting back your Labyrinth card that easily. Hadoken! See ya. God said no, buddy. What, you, what else you got, Rikasa? Ooh, more face downs. Well, that's to be expected, though. Ooh, that's what I like to see. Just setting face downs and ending your turn? That's what I like to see. Ooh, gravity collapse. Hmm. Okay. Alright, alright. Okay. Alright, so we protected that. Let's go for this Zoha right away before any of our cards in our hand get sniped. Zoha, uh huh. What is that? Dogmatica Punishment. Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense, honestly. That's a good move. They'll probably send Natis. Yeah. And then with Natis, special summon a fiend from your graveyard. Okay. Target a card. Yeah, okay. They wised up. I guess they finally figured out, like, you can't, uh... <laughs> you can't destroy Melusine. Mm-hmm. And that gets set back. Okay, okay. Well, they got basically full combo there. Hmm. Interesting, though. Uh, here I could actually still use Zoha's effects. Not sure I want to, but, uh... Hmm. Hmm. Does this, uh, da -da -da -da. no, is it this one? Whenever I add cards. 
Um, no. Um, you can use. Oh, I guess I could could use Zoha. Okay, sure, let's use Zoha. We'll just get another Nunu if he lets us. So. So Zoha, we'll let him draw a card, and then we'll get to add Nunu. Ba -doo -ba -doo. Okay. So yeah, we'll take. Should I take King? No, no, no. Cause he uh he banished the other Nunu, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Taking Nunu is definitely the right call here. Uh, we'll just send Nunu. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Very good. Do 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 do. Okie dokie. And now we will... Oh, he's got more. Ooh! <laughs> smart, smart, smart play. Mmm, how many reptiles we got in the grave? One, two, three, four. So I could use Water Lily to revive something. Hmm. Yeah, I could. Uh, ooh! What if I revive an alien for Planet Pollutant Virus? That might be a smart call. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, let's uh, water Lily. Because he can pop cards on the field, too. So, yeah, let's activate water Lily here. Now, monsters in the grave can't activate their effects, right? So, I won't get the A counters, but I will. Gets a special summon this, I think, due to Water Lily. Yes, I can. Okay, good, 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 good. Special summon. Uh. Well, I haven't used Nunu this turn, have I? Let's just special summon this for now. Oh, wait, I can't special summon Nunu. I just went over that. So, defense mode. Mm hmm. Alright. Now we can play Planet Pollutant Virus anytime we want. Should I play it now? Hmm. Let's see. Let me think here. I guess I should, and then just try to get some damage in. If nothing else, I'll force him to use whatever that last trap it is. So, yeah. Old Virus here. There we go. I probably might have wanted to wait on that, but it's okay if I messed it up. Not too big of a deal. Yeah, like I said, this will force him to do something. Mm-hmm. Alright, and then we just try to attack with Reptilian Melusine. Let's do it. Get a Melusine. Alright, we're good, we're good. I am my turn. Alright. So far so good. So far so good. In phase, are they gonna play Welcome Labyrinth? No, they didn't play anything. Good. Alright, your turn, Rikasa. There's the Welcome Labyrinth. Okay, so there probably comes another lovely lady. Do, 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 do. Oh, they have a Shuffler in the grave, too. Ooh, I just realized that. Okay. So, no matter what, we don't want to go for Venomenon or Venomenaga because, uh, yeah. <laughs> It'll just get probably get shuffled back. So, well, wait, 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 wait. Just a second. Isn't, uh... Monsters... Wait, Soul Drain activates him, too. Uh, prevents him, too, though, right? From activating effects in the graveyard? So I don't have to worry about Shufflers, actually. As long as he has the Soul Drain up, our Water Lily is good. Right? I'm pretty sure, yeah. That's crazy. Ooh, damage equals Reptile. Wait, wait, wait. Dude, this is perfect because I have how many Engrave? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I have five Reptiles Engrave. Hmm. 
Let's just, uh, let's force the Welcome Labyrinth. Or force him to take damage. Yeah, because I want him to trigger this... Yeah, 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 yeah. When I don't have any cards he can destroy. So, let's see here. Defense mode, interesting. Let's see, so what does this do? Add a Labyrinth card for... Okay, okay. Makes sense. He's doing a lot of deck searching. Uh, I just hope he doesn't draw into a Compulse, like I said, or like a Kaiju or something. Uh huh. I guess we'll continue to attack. Yep. There we go. Yeah, because if I would have set. Whenever, if you activate a set Welcome Labyrinth, yeah, you can destroy one card on the field. So, I definitely played that right. So, now we set Damage Equals Reptile. Okay. Set Damage Equals Reptile. And if uh, Rikasa gets out the big girl, lovely lady once again, then, uh, yeah, if she attacks, you know, we'll take 400, and we can get out Venomanon with that. Okay. Man, they're getting rid of a lot of hand traps. Crow, Maxi. There it is again. So, yeah. This deck, this deck's really good at recycling Welcome Labyrinth, though. So, it's only once per turn, but still. <sighs> nope. So, yeah, our back row's probably getting pops here. Probably. That's why, I, that's why I said, like, yeah, if you're facing this deck, get rid of the field spell, like, ASAP. As a matter of fact, banish the field spell, if you can. You know, if you can't, then you can't, so. Nope. Well, I guess I could have activated it. Gotten the credit for activating a trap. Let's see what you've got. Hmm. Another Labyrinth girl. Okay. So you can add a Labyrinth card. Oops, I should have used the effect there. That's my bad. That's totally my bad. Okay. Stovey. Mm-hmm. Main one. Another face down. All right, one more turn on the virus. Uh, let's see. So far, Mus Mulesine is holding the line, though. I guess we'll keep this in hand this time. No need to set it. Let's see. Actually, I will set it. You know what? I just want to make sure they keep taking out the face down there. All right. Attack. Hmm. Uh, what in the world? Ooh. Hmm. Ooh, that'll do it. Terrors of the what? Of the overroot. Wow, because that does say sin, yeah? Ooh, that'll do it. Well, yep, yeah, Rikasa finally outed it, man. <laughs> that took a while, but... Yeah, they finally found a card that doesn't, you know, just outright destroy. Hmm. Yeah. Well, we might be... We might be the hand bone now. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> Whoa. <Well>, uh -oh. <laughs> yeah.
Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. I had someone at the door. The door, the door, the door, the door. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we would have lost that one anyway, though. Let's see. So we still need two exceeds and two trap cards. Okay. Um, let me double check what's going on here. Oh, it's giving in. You know, right to left. And. <laughs> Alright. And we'll go. Here. Alright. Back to the championship. Alrighty. Second. Okay, so today we faced uh, what labyrinth and start <laughs> uh, sword soul silent magician level eight uh, Stardust turbo. Pretty interesting variety here. Okay, we're going second, so tier elements. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna probably scoop here pretty soon. Yeah, as a matter of fact, like uh, I need my graveyard, so I'm not even gonna waste my time on this one. Yeah, it's tier. We scooping boys. We scooping boys and girls. Yeah. I got the wrong deck for this matchup. Do, 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 do. All right, so it took until we were level seven to finally see a tier deck, but there's the first one. Do, do. Scotty, Scotty doesn't know. I was about to say that other word, but then I realized like, oh hey, I'm streaming on Twitch. Maybe I shouldn't say that. Because you're not allowed to say certain words, so... Do, 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 Scotty doesn't know... Scotty doesn't know... Man, we drew Venomanaga again. Wow. Oh, he let us go first? Uh, okay. Well, in that case, let's go for... Uh, Stealth Burster Defense. And we'll play Kaiser. I guess, yeah. Defense. Kaiser! Let's see if you can make it past my one Floodgates. Alright, I am my turn. Oh, uh, yeah. One of my favorite things to do in this deck, though, is to go into the uh, Kaiser with... Uh, with the Reptile the Yan Synchro, the one we just played last duel, <laughs> that is pretty annoying, you know, especially if I have like a Solemn or something to back it up. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, okay. He had the Duster. Alrighty, Scotty. The world's your oyster, buddy. Oh, man. Okay. Good thing I didn't set Limit Verse 2. Black Wings! I'm shocked. Shocked, I tell you. <laughs> do, 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 do. Wait, you cannot special summon during this turn. Wait, what? Oh, I just realized you cannot special. Well, unless they gain additional normal summons. Also, we didn't see Black Whirlwind. That's a good sign. But yeah, unless you gain additional normal summons, we should be fine here. Uh. Wow. Okay. That turn could have went a lot worse for us, but uh, I guess we'll activate Stealth Burster. Yeah, he dusters for only one card, and uh, <laughs> he popped Colosseum, but he only was going to summon one monster anyway. So that's interesting. Yeah, that turn could have went way, way worse than it did. Okay, my turn. Snake D at T. 
Well, well, well. Um, well, he's free to special summon next turn. We don't have much going on here, so I guess we'll just do whatever damage I can. We'll try to get rewards for popping this card and doing some damage, but uh, yeah, this ain't looking good. This ain't the ideal hand here. Mm, if we had Venomenon in the grave, maybe. And Snake Rain or something, but uh, yeah, we'll set a couple bluffs here and attack directly. Alright, Coach, we'll get him. Bum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Magic Cylinder in a Blackwing deck? Hmm. <laughs> interesting, my friend. Interesting. Very interesting. And he only used it on 1400 attack as well. Hmm. I guess, although that does. If nothing else, yeah, that does put me in like OTK range, I guess. I think that's the only reason you'd want to do that, you know. Oh, he got the main player, so. Yep. Now he can synchro from the deck. Right, he's still free to special summon too, so. Okie dokie. Well, if he does his combos right, this should be the last turn. So let me let me check what's going on in in the chat, if anything. Right here. Okay, we're good. And I think we can still hear the audio, yeah? Yeah? We still hear the audio? Oh yeah, let me check the audio actually. Oh, we took some more burn damage. Yeah, looks like we're still going, right? Okay. Yep, audio and everything sounds fine. Kalu! Damage tip, Kalu. And that gives me flashbacks to uh, the Yu Gi Oh! progression series by Simo. I can't believe we didn't lose there. What? Wow, like, uh. Hmm. I guess because they didn't get Black Whirlwind. But uh, wow, I am shocked we get another turn here. Uh. uh new, new. Okay, okay. Okay, new, new. Let me think here. Wait, we have limit reverse face down, right? Oh my god, what? Um. Okay, well, if this doesn't get ashed, we're actually in good shape. Activate. New, new. Okay. New, new, mil, now, yeah. Uh, no, don't chain. Do not chain. Oh my god, are we actually good here? Uh. Yeah, now, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh. Okay, so now we activate Limit Reverse. Limit Reverse. Ba -da -na -na. Take back the Dark One. Now, yeah, return to me now. Activate Now, yeah. Search Water Lily. Um, yep, mm-hmm. Activate new new engrave. Uh-huh. Okay. We still have a normal summon either, have we? So what is all in the grave? Right, just Kotal and hmm. Let me think here. And we can water lily something. Ooh, I just had a fun thought. What if we go King of the Feral Imps? Uh-huh. Overlay. Uh-huh. Oops. Overlay. We go... King here. Uh-huh. King of the Feral Imps. Detach for King of the Feral Imps. New, new to the grave. What if we take Alien Ammonites? Yeah. 
Uh-huh. And then, what if I... What if I send... Uh... Shock Trooper to the graveyard. I mean, not Shock Trooper, Stealth Burster, but before I do that, is this card immune to card effects? Okay, nope. Sounds good to me. Ideal. Alien Shock Trooper. Stealth Burster, I mean. Yeah, I keep saying Shock Trooper. Okay, Stealth Burster effects. Uh huh. Place two counters on King. We summon Alien Omni. There's no way we gotta broke this board with one Nyuya draw. Omanite effects. Revive Stealth Burster. Act in attack mode. Uh huh. Summon. Uh, ooh, yeah, we could also go into Echidna. Ooh, we could go into BLS, which would be hilarious. Uh, but no, I think the right play here is definitely Golgar, so... Access the Synchro Network. Idiot. Cosmic Fortress. Golgar. Ain't no way, son. There we go. Uh, activate effects. Destroy. Uh-huh. So we'll remove these two from King. Uh-huh. And he already used uh, Zephyros, yeah? Uh, destroy this. Bye-bye. <laughs> Activate Golgar. Place the counter on the monsters. Uh-huh. Bounce them at reverse. Uh, place the counter on this, on Golgar. Set limit reverse. <laughs> Dude. Oh my god. Uh, oh man, what if he has another Kalut though? Nah, he would have played it last turn to end the game, right? Alright, King of the Pharaoh Imps, get him. Yeah, you ain't got no Kalut, son. Alright, Golgar, direct attack. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, well, his board is clear. But, let's see. All he needs is 800 damage though. That's the problem. Oh, no, no, no. No thank you on the limit reverse. Hmm. Okay. What is that? Oster. Uh, when this is normal summoned. Ooh. That's pretty good, yeah. Because that'll let him go into an 8, right? Ooh. Okay, and then he can... Wait, he didn't use the effect? Oh, well, either way, he got uh, enough for a level 8 synchro. And the crown... Does... Maybe they have another level 8 synchro, though, that can get him 800 damage. Or, or got, got, got a cowboy. No, he's synchroing. It is the same one. Okay. Interesting. Well, this doesn't end the game unless he plays something else. Because we would only lose 500 max from King. Ooh, oh, no, no, no. He gets the wedge counter. Ah, smart. Okay. Well done, good sir. Well done. Mmm. And then he gets the burn effect, yeah? Uh. Wow. Smart. Well, that's one way to do it. Yep. Alrighty. Not bad, though. Not bad. So he seemed to be running more of a kind of a Blackwing burn version. Uh, because we've mostly seen, like, the OTK version. Uh, but the burn version's kind of good. Almost like the burn version better. It's a it seems to be a little more unique, you know? Do 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 do. Okay. Alright, well, we got our daily. That's the main thing I, I really wanted to do, do this stream. 
not necessarily, uh, you know, uh, all of these missions. We've got plenty of days to do them, but the main thing I wanted to do is the dailies. Oh, we just need the trap card one. Okay. So let's go back. And here we go. And there we go. I guess I could have activated a uh, limit reverse at the end there. We could have got credit for the trap, but it's all good. It's all good. Karibo. How do you say that? Ru. Do you say it Ru. Ru dig? Er? Or would it be Rudiger? Or would it be like a. Uh, isn't there a, like a. Like a gun called like a Ruger? Is that would be how you say it? I don't know. No extra deck. Are we up against a bot? Or monarchs? Or a burn deck? Let's find out. No extra deck is always highly suspicious. This is a monarch deck. I knew it. <laughs> I freaking called it on that one. I was like, are we up against a bot? Or a monarch? And he is, um, okay, yeah, this is going to be a bit of a long term. Oh, I'm going to stretch a little bit here. Yeah. Monarch decks are surprisingly consistent. A pendulum card and a monarch deck. Say it ain't so. What was that? What was that abomination? Wait, wait. From your... Oh, I see. Ancha Mo Frite. If you have no cards in your extra deck, except you can destroy this card and draw one card, and then he special summons himself? Wow. And then you get out Ether. Interesting. And then Ether recycles Pantheism, right? I'm pretty sure I remember how most of these cards work. Uh, during your opponent's main phase, you can banish a monarch tribute to summon. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's pretty good, yeah. And he got Erebus. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good, that's pretty good. Once per turn, either player's turn, you can discard. Yep. Add it to the hand, and Domain locks me out of the extra deck, right? Yes. While you have no cards and are the only player that controls a tribute summon monster. Hmm. Interesting. So we have to select a card to give them. Um. Erupt. Well, we don't definitely don't want to give them erupt. So we'll give them tenacity. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, we. This this deck locks us down hard, bro. We got our work cut out for us in this one. Okay. Let me think here. Ooh. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Snake rain, huh? The problem is we can't play monsters from the extra deck. Yeah, that's the biggest problem. Uh, let's use Nunu here. Hmm. Wow. So with Nunu, we can send, uh... Hmm. Nunu, what should I send? Let's send this for now. Because I have Snake Rain, so... And since he didn't negate that, I'm assuming he's not going to negate Snake Rain. I just have to think here. There's got to be some combination of cards that... Let's me get out of this. The main thing, our goal is to not let him control a tribute summon monster anymore. Easier said than done against the Monarch deck, but maybe we can do it here. Do I want to discard Limit Reverse? What's even in his grave? Psh, monarch decks don't have grave effects anyway, right? Now let's get rid of Called By. Yeah. Change this to on real quick. Okay, let me think here. What can get us out of this situation? Hmm, maybe Aron. They do add cards a lot. This card has decent defense. And this special summons from the grave, right? Not the... Uh, 
It gains attack, though. That's the problem, yeah. Hmm. I'm thinking here. Well, I think we want one Stealth Burster, for sure. Maybe Aron will help, though. Maybe. And... I mean, at least it's a, a special summon that's better than nothing. And I guess Ammonite? In case we do break this war... Wait, maybe... Ooh, Telepath. Can I revive Telepath somehow? Not currently, but Telepath would help. Like, a lot. Let's mill Telepath, actually. And I'll also... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep Aron in the deck. Let's mill Ammonite. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we should get Stealth Burster here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that way at least if we somehow can draw into the other Avian Ammonite, uh, we can bring back Telepath and pop Domain. That's best case scenario right there. Okay. And we'll set this. And I guess... Hmm, what if they have Mobius? Maybe I should keep this in my hand. Uh... Do I set the other Stealth Burster? I probably should, just to not get OTK'd. Okay. Your turn, buddy. Your turn, Ruger. Or however you say your name. Yeah, Monarchs counter us hard, bro. Hmm. Nope. Oh man, Aron would have been good first turn, though. I for sure would have uh, special summoned it as much as possible if we got to go first, though. See, in the no extra deck, that's like a huge hint of what you're up against. Tenacity. Yeah. Yeah. What is it? Who? What's that? Well, he got erupt. Yeah, hang, hang on. I'll be on in a sec. Uh, erupt. Hmm. Right, lowering er Erebus down to two. Hmm. What is that? Uh, right. Stormforth. Yeah, these decks do love that. Hmm. That gets rid of my Stealth Burster, though, is the problem. Hmm. All right. Well, there's Erebus. I guess we'll activate the effect here on this. Hmm. Oh boy. Yeah, ripping the cards out of that hand, that sucks. Hmm. Oh, no, I didn't rip it. It just got shuffled into the deck. That's interesting. Pretty interesting. Mm-hmm. Bump ba dump ba dump ba dump ba dump. Nah. Well, somehow we made it past this turn. Hmm. Boop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. I guess this effect only activates when he's attacking monsters. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just read the ga gain 800. I'm like, man, why didn't you use the effect? It'd only be down to 800. But, uh, no, that makes sense. So we should set the negate. Yeah, the monster negate. Hmm, should I use Limit Reverse here? Oh, I forgot to mill, uh... 
Man, I forgot to mill Nauya, the dark one. That's my bad, yeah. Hmm. Well, let's see here. Ooh. That could help, honestly, in the situation. Uh-huh. No cards in your extra. During your end phase, if you control no tribute, summon monsters. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. We might be able to survive next turn here. Oops. I should have activated Center Serpent. Okay, good. We got it. Good, good, good. Okay. Uh huh. Nah, I don't chain that. Uh huh. So, which of these is more dangerous? Uh, da -da 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 if this card is tribute summon during your opponent's main phase, oh, if it's in your hand. Oh, I see, I see. During your opponent's main phase, you can discard. Hmm. In your graveyard? He ain't got none in his graveyard. Oh, and also, this can recur this, if nothing else. Well, I guess I'll get rid of Erebus. Yeah, because you can recur stuff from the graveyard. So, Stealth Burster. I can still activate effects from the graveyard, buddy. Hey. <laughs> yeah. So, we'll destroy this. Uh huh. Nope. And actually, like I said, I can't activate effects from the graveyard. Hmm, maybe I chose the right card after all. Let's activate Zoha. Let's see if we can set some bait here. I'll send Sinister Serpent to the grave. Uh huh. Nope. Don't change anything. Zoha. Uh huh. Alright, let's see if this works. We'll set Zoha way over here. Okay. And we'll play one face down, Red Uger. Yeah. <laughs> you got nine cards in your graveyard. Are we finally going to be able to... Every time we've had Ghost of a Grudge, it's been negated. <laughs> like, like last stream, I actually got to prompt it uh, like three times, which is actually rare. Sometimes it can be hard to get for the opponent to get eight cards in their graveyard, you know, it, when you want them to, uh, and not have any like shufflers or anything. But this might be the first time we get it to actually resolve. Let's see. I hope so. That would be really cool. Because that's like the whole reason this card's in the decks, because like no one expects this card. Plus, of course, this works pretty good with. Uh... Let me show it here with the Reptilian, yeah, Hydra. Yeah, this works really good, because with Hydra, yeah, destroy as many monsters as your opponent control with zero, and draw one card for each. That's basically why Ghost of a Grudge is in the deck. Oh, he's going for it, he's going for it. Wait for it, wait for it. We can activate this in damage step, right? Good, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Battle step, damage step, damage step. <laughs> Ghost of a Grudge. You got a solemn back there? Ooh. <laughs> yes. Oh, we got it to resolve for the first time. Nice. <laughs> Take that. Take that, Ether. Nice. Alright, we did it. Survived a turn. <laughs> All right, he's gonna use Erebus. You can do what? Uh, discard a monarch to our trap. Okay, so he's adding. What do you add? Uh, I guess he added Ether back. Yeah. Or he added himself. Okay, no, he did add Ether. Okay. Alrighty. <laughs> Okay. 
the good part is... Well, hang on. Oh, right. I forgot he had the Prime, too, in his graveyard. Well, the luck's not done yet. He's going to tribute summon for Ether here again. But we did survive the turn. That's the main thing. So. Yeah. Reduce Ether. Pretty common combo there. Uh-huh. Hmm. How many reptiles we got in the grave? One, two, three, four, five. Oh wait, but my effects are negated, yeah. Hmm, yeah. Funnily enough, if we hard draw into Venomanon, <laughs> we could actually be okay here. Yeah, we would have to like hard draw into Venomanon though. That's pretty funny. Activating Pantheonism here. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess I'll give you Prime. What does this one do? Well, we definitely don't want to give him that one. But we will give him Prime. That's probably the worst one out of all those. I mean, all three are good, but uh, Prime is just kind of like insulation, basically, is what it is. Alrighty. Okay, and Ether returns there. Uh, funny, I could actually save Sinister Serpent there, but no. See ya, Sinister Serpent. You did good, though. You got me back, Zoha, to defend for one turn. Hmm. Nope. What do we draw here? Hmm. A kaiju. But we can't special summon, though, right? We can't even special summon kaijus? Oh no, we can. Hmm, interesting. Let's activate Nyuya. Hmm. Oh, he has a response. Uh, okay. Prime Monarch. Oh, okay. No, that makes sense, that makes sense. So, Nyuya. There we go. Nope. Limit reverse. We can bring back... Right, Ammonite. Ammonite. Wait, what? Wait, why can't I special summon this now? Uh, I'm sorry? Is it this? Let me think here. What's stopping me from kaiju in it? Because I had the option before. Uh, what am I missing here? Um, is it Prime? It has to be, yeah? No, no, no. I know it's... It's not Domain. Um, I don't know what's locking me here. Hang on. Weird. Huh, because they gave me the option before to special summon it. Um, weird. Let me try this. Let me try to play Limit Reverse. 
Because we, we can definitely still special summon. As proof of the Ammonite. Hmm. What is that? Escalation? Uh oh. <laughs> That's pretty good. Hmm. <laughs> nice. Nice. Gave us sphere mode. Uh. No. no. That is hilarious. <laughs> Alright, well, now for some reason we can play our kaiju. Um, but now it doesn't really do us much good, huh? Um, huh. Interesting. During the end phase of the next turn. Well, I think we might have bought ourselves a turn, though. Funnily enough, him giving us fear mode does give us a turn. That is crazy. <laughs> Escalation into a sphere mode. Well, I've seen everything now. Uh, let me check on chat here. This still is pretty intense, man. <laughs> oh, and he gave us a sphere mode, man. <laughs> uh, that was pretty smart, though. That was pretty smart. But I think, yeah, yeah, despite everything, cause, because uh, sphere mode was tribute summon like that, its effects still work. So... That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, it's fear mode the whole time. Yeah. Well, we made it past one more turn. Hmm. down to 19 cards in his deck. Holy crap. Error bursts his back. Yeah. Oh wait, this is gonna get uh, the kaiju out of my hand, yeah? Uh-huh. Yep. Or maybe he's gonna get rid of sphere mode? I could see him doing that. Oh, no, no. Okay. Hmm. Well, I think this is it, boys and girls. Not many things I can draw here. Huh. Hmm. Kid, huh? Well, that's not really going to do it. I will... I'll just play kid in attack mode. Just because. Hmm. <laughs> nice. And he can escalation. In the battle phase or main phase. Yeah. Boy, oh boy. <clears throat> yeah, we just got locked down in this one. We got locked down hard. Yeah, and this is kind of well. Besides the, besides the wing dragon of raw effect, uh, this is basically kind of standard. You know, when the monarch structure deck first came out, you just uh, put three of everything, and uh, yeah, you got a pretty solid deck. But honestly, it's it's a, a <laughs> like uh, monarchs are so. You hardly, I hardly ever duel against monarchs against uh, monarch players here in Master Duels, so it's honestly nice to see something kind of refreshing. All right, that's pretty good. Like we would have needed Duster or Lightning Storm to get out of that one because we were just getting locked down very hard, mostly by domain. But uh, I mean, yeah. 
we definitely would have needed like lightning swarm or duster early like really early so not bad okay let me uh, there was someone knocking on my door earlier so let me go check here real quick and I'll be right back Doo -doo -doo -doo. all right got all the dailies good good that's kind of the main thing I wanted to do this stream so that's good all right here my fan a little closer. Man, that feels better. Uh, let me check on the state of things. We good? We good? We good, G? I think we're so good. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we're good. Okay, so... Wait, why does it say rerun there? I don't know why it says that. Because I'm not streaming a rerun. I art live. Yeah. Anyway. Let's go back. Let's go here. And let's go here. Okay, yeah, I think I'll just go for in about 45 minutes and call it good. Oh no, I actually, I'll probably just go for about 30 minutes. Yeah, because we did have like a 15 minute stream to start, so like a 20 minute stream. New, new, first turn, very good. Hmm, we also got Planet Pollutant Virus. New, new. Show me that ash. 
Show me that Maxi. <laughs> Man, I remember yesterday people kept shotgunning Maxi. Is it Maxi? Oh, it's Ash. Okay. Well, that doesn't matter too much. I mean, we just don't get to mill uh, Naoya. Okie dokie. No, no. This is the part you should have asked, buddy. Yeah, where I get the special summon. Special summon, you see? Okay, so we can go. Let me think. Telepath. I could save Telepath for Planet Pollutant Virus. Oh, but we do have Wabaku. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Eh, I think I want Telepath in the grave, actually. We'll go into King of the Imps. King. Yeah. Huzzah! And you've already played Ash, so I'm not even worried about this getting negated. Uh, detach Nunu. -nu. Add Armanite. Nice. Okay, and we'll set uh, one Wabaku. Defense mode. Ooh. Ending the turn. Ooh. 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 Okay, well, we got another Nunu. Ooh. This could be really good for us. Um. Okay, let's uh, detach Telepath. Now we get to add whatever we want. Um, oh, he scooped. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I was getting ready to say defense mode. On that one, I guess, I guess he bricked. I mean, yeah. Uh, can we see what it, deck keep is running though? Uh, yeah, we can. Okay, okay. Uh, oh no, it just says replay. You cannot check their deck? Oh no. Huh. I guess you cannot. That is unfortunate. Uh, usually like in ranked over there, you know, if you hit match history, you can check whatever deck they were playing, but yeah, I kind of just wanted to see like, what was that guy on for him to... I guess we'll never know. Because all we saw out of him was one Ash, and that tells me nothing. Oh, when to level up. Eh, if we lose, it's not too big of a deal, man. Nothing done. Oh yeah, yesterday we faced uh, Melfi's like once, too? We faced a Melfi deck like once. Uh, let me check what time it is, too. I'm not going to check stream, I just want to see what time it is. 5.40, okay. Yeah, I did say we'd go about 40 minutes, so I'll try to end it at like 6.20. That sounds good. We'll call it a day. And I've got no interruptions, so we'll set this to off. Two face downs! Let's, let me guess. Called by Imperm. That's usually a pretty good guess. St two Stealth Burster. Okay, and we... Well, we, this hand's decent. We got a Kaiju, Code A, and Raijiki. Hmm. Maybe we should just go with Stealth Burster and not play anything else face down. I, I'll play the limit reverse to face down. Just a bluff. Just a bluff. Just a bluff. Oh, he's thinking. Okay. Battle time. Although, Code A, if each time an alien's destroyed, hmm. Nah. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, we could get extra A counters, potentially, but I don't want to leave this sitting out for it to get, like, dusted or lightning stormed. So, let's main phase two. Let's set limit reverse as a bluff. Yeah. He's thinking. Something on in phase? No. 
Oh, okay. Yeah, we got some good stuff, like Raijiki, a Kaiju. Hmm, let's see what kind of deck they're running now. What is this? Dragon Maid. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. There's one thing Dragon Maids love, it's the battle phase. And if there's another thing, it's fusing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we haven't seen Dragon Maid or Blue Eyes or I don't even think we've seen a Dark Magician deck here in the uh, in the championship either. Uh-oh, is this gonna be a... Uh, like the rocket combo? Oh, I think it is. That's not good, because I'm pretty sure this combo can OTK. Yeah, where you get, like, boot sector launch and stuff? Ooh. Hmm. Well, let's see if they've got the full combo. Huh. Yeah, because this could be, like, Dragon Link uh, Turbo, basically. Hmm. Yep, Romulus. This looks very familiar. Hmm. Yep, he got Ravine. That's not good. Of course, the main card they want is a uh, Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon. But, uh, yeah, this deck can be pretty good. And then they'll set a uh, Boot Sector launch. Yep, getting a rocket to the hand. Yeah, this ain't good. Tracer, yep, yep, yep. yep. Hmm. Honestly, not too much I could have done differently here, though. I guess the only thing I could have done differently is play Code A. Maybe just play defensively, but I don't really see what good that would have done. Uh, hmm. Do 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 do. Tracer. Mm hmm. For Pitsy, yeah. Yep. And this should be a. Yep, another Striker Dragon. Uh huh. Do 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 do. And there comes Absolute Dragon. Wow. Or would you say Router? Absolute Router Dragon? No, it probably is Router. Deligerous. Yeah. Hmm. Basically, he's trying to get enough rockets in his hand to uh, activate this part of the effect, I think. Yeah, to where you can special summon up to two. Yeah. Do 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 do. Mm hmm. There's Tracer again. And Deligerous once again. Mm hmm. But yeah, this is basically a standard uh, Dragon Link deck. Ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. This should be a Link 5. Yep. Boral End Drag. Do -do 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 -do. Negate the monster's effects on the field. Okay. As long as you're not negating my effect in the graveyard, I mean. Cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. Ah. That's all I need to know. Boral End Dragon? Yeah, Boral Lords have a dragon. And he'll attach one of the, uh. Mm hmm. Very good. So he's got two negates. Well, I guess. <laughs> I guess we'll stealth burster on this, since this can't be destroyed by card effects anyway. So, yep. Oh, he's gonna negate. Wow, that's surprising. I thought it would have been harder to bait the negates from that, but okay. 
We'll take it. The good part is, I mean, I can kaiju this. That's this card is not an issue at all. Um, the problem is, hmm, that doesn't really help us either. The problem is, he still got Warlord Savage. Hmm. You guys think I can bait Warlord Savage with Code? Well, let's try it. Cause I do have an alien card in my graveyard. Maybe he'll just straight up button click. Uh huh. Max C. Say it ain't so. Hmm. Well, we did bait the Max C. Hmm. I kind of need to Raigeki here, though. Hmm. Okay, let's, uh. Kaiju you this right here. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's a good idea. That's a good idea I just came up with. What if I... Stealth Burster throw myself into the Kaiju. Maybe he'll negate Stealth Burster again. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, and this doesn't protect, does it? Uh... Da -da 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 Mm, 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 if attach... Okay, no it doesn't. I didn't think so. Alright, Stealth Burster, you're my boy. I just need your effects. Uh-huh. Yep. And then Stealth Burster. Uh-huh. Aha! Got him. I knew you'd negate it. I knew you would. I knew I could count on you, nothing done. And now, we main phase two. I activate Thunderbolt. This destroys all monsters on your field. Ooh, interesting. Well, yeah, I mean, you were gonna get destroyed anyway, so might as well do that. Might as well get rid of my one and only A counter. That makes sense. But we did out his, uh, <laughs> It's pretty impressive board there. Uh, and I guess we'll keep code A in hand. Yeah, might as well. Might as well. Okay. <laughs> I had my turn. <laughs> I'm surprised we, we could even out that. Uh, that was uh, pretty good, honestly. The only thing I regret is not kaijuing right away, because he had Max C, you know. But it's all good. Mm-hmm. Okay. Battle phase, what? Oh, right, 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 right. Dragon Mage do do that. So, he might get enough damage here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's good. 2700. That'll do it. That'll do, pig. That'll do. <laughs> Man, we added that board hard, though. <laughs> Alright. I'm proud of ourselves for that one, honestly. That's a hard board to out. Alright. One more. Do 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 do. Moa Cannon. V Vaughn. Alright, I guess we'll try going first. <sighs> we haven't seen Summon Limit all day. Or any of my other floodgate. Well, no, we saw Kaiser. We saw Kaiser Coliseum once. Interesting first hand here. Pretty interesting. Alright. There's Nauya. Alright. It's time. Show me that ash. No. Okay. We'll, we'll play Nauya. Show me that Maxi. Show it to me. No Maxi. Okay. Well, maybe I should play this. Uh, hmm. Should I? Yeah, let's play Viper's Rebirth here. Yeah, that way we can get this uh, Nyuya's effects uh, right here. Nyuya! Nice. 
Okay, so we can search for water though the first turn. Uninterrupted, I like that. I like the idea of that. Water lily. We still have a normal summon. Huh. But this is getting destroyed at the end and this, yeah, so we definitely want to overlay those two. Kind of skirt the rules on the destruction and the Nyuya destruction effects. So, overlay. And we go for this right here. There we go. Uh-huh. King of the Feral Imps. Okay, and we also have Alien Kid. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty good. We'll go for Alien Kid. Now, what should I search for here? So, we detach Nunu. So, we have Kid and Feral. I guess I sh Hmm, maybe I should search for Telepath, honestly. Because he's going to have at least one thing with an A counter, I bet you. Yeah, I could search for Telepath. I could search for Mars. Hmm. Yeah, Mars would be pretty hilarious, depending on the situation. Well, I tell you what, boys and girls, we'll search... We'll just do the safe search for this turn. We'll do Ammonite this turn. And if Feral Imp survives next turn, maybe we will play Mars for the first time. Uh, we'll set damage equals reptile right here. Do I play limit reverse? Mm -hmm. Sure. Why not? Okay. I turned my endo. What you got, Vivon? Hmm. Not a bad first turn for us. Well, there are better ones, but there are worse ones. At one turn where we popped off, we had Zero Wall and uh, uh, Golgar, and we had something else on board, Stealth Burster. Yeah, that was a pretty killer turn. This one's okay, though. It's an okay start. What kind of deck? 36, 7, 8, 9, 40. 42 card deck. Hmm. Are we going to see Wing Beast again? Penguin! Ooh, this is activated. You can add one Penguin card from your deck to your hand. Maybe they're just using the penguin engine, though. If we see full power penguins... Matter of fact, if we lose to full power penguins, I'll be so happy. Because I actually love penguin soldiers. It's one of my favorite cards. Uh-huh. You can decrease the level. Uh -huh. it's pretty good, yeah. Let you reduce the card you just searched from a 5-star to a 4-star, right? Yeah, great emperor penguin. Shadals! Aw, oh, come on, bro. You're not running full power, Penguin. You tease. You tease me, good sir. Oh, I'm insulted now. So you're running like some... Probably running like Branded Fusion or something. Aw, oh, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Can change its battle position. Uh, okay. I mean, I don't know why you'd use that effect, but, um... <laughs> okay. Maybe they can get something slightly over 2,000, but not 23. I don't know. Basically, what that just read to me is uh, save save the opposing player some uh, battle damage, which I don't know if you necessarily want to do, but okay. That's fine by me. Do, 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 do. Okay. King in defense. That's fine. Da, da, ba, ba, ba. And there's the Emperor Penguin. Okay. What else she got? Right? Two special summons from the deck is pretty cool, though. I must admit. But yeah, if you are facing, like, Penguin Engine or whatever, you definitely want to Ash this. Because, you know, two special summons from the deck is, uh, yeah. You don't want to allow that. Like, ever. Ever, ever. Alright, you guys get some A counters. A. Alright. Penguin Squire. Mm-hmm. Royal Penguin Squire. That's cool. What's this? Crawler! Oh, this guy is cooking. This guy is cooking. Uh, uh huh. Okay. This guy is cooking.
Mmm. Oh, okay. I see why he runs the Shadals now. That makes sense, yeah. Because he's running crawlers too. Alright, what's next? So this is a level 5 tuner. This is a level 6. You can reduce, ooh, by 2 or 4. I see. So you can go to a uh, rank 7? Uh, a level 7 synchro now? Hmm. Oh, you can go to a level... Holy crap. Wow. Well, we're getting a lot of 8 counters out here. Hmm. Wow, this can special summon two monsters? Different names equal to the amount reduced. Wow. This is a pretty good deck. I wish we could look at the recipe at the end here. But, uh... Subterra Behemoth Fiendus. Hmm. Interesting. Send one flip monster. Uh huh. From your hand, face down. Interesting. Right, that's the penguin squire effect. Ah. This makes this makes a lot of sense. Yeah, with Venus, it actually makes a lot of sense. I was wondering. I was like, man, why play the subterra card? But no, no, no. no. With its uh, yeah, with its effect. Mm hmm. Yeah, you can get an extra special summon. Is that Guard Dog? Oh, no way, bro. Guard Dog. <laughs> oh, man, Guard Dog is so good. So, if you guys don't know, Guard Dog is a flip effect monster that says flip. Destroy all special summon monsters on your opponent's field. It's actually really, really good. Uh, yeah. That is interesting. It's actually quite a hilarious tech to put in penguins. Uh, because penguin decks, if you don't know, they can, um, on a... If they get their synchro out, on a quick effect, they can basically flip one card on the field that's face down, face up. So, basically by setting Guard Dog, which that's what I'm assuming he said here, uh, you can basically wait till your opponent special summons like, yeah, three or four monsters, and then just use the uh, Penguin Synchro effect, and yeah, just flip up uh, Guard Dog, you're good to go. <laughs> that is hilarious. Yep. And if nothing else, he can take out my uh, Feral Imps, which he actually can't uh, take out yet. But I mean, this guy can still link and stuff, so, you know. Yeah, but that's a pretty hilarious uh, interaction there. <laughs> yep, guard, de guard Dog for Tech. That is, that is a new one, man. That's a good one, too. Alright, is he going into the penguin synchro now? Aw, goody! Boo! Boo! Come on. Go into the penguin synchro so I can show people. Boo! Alright, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, this this guy cooked some good stuff up though. Vivon. This is probably the most interesting deck we've seen in the last uh, couple days I've streamed. Mm-hmm. And you get... Oh, wow, he got back Penguin. Uh, is, this effect's not once per turn, by the way. This effect is not once per turn. Holy crap. <laughs> so all he has to do is make room on his board, like, Link... I don't know, Link or Synchro, these two. And then, uh... Yeah, he can use Penguin again. Great Emperor Penguin again. Holy crap. Yeah, there he goes. Alright, what are you doing this time? Okay, show the Penguin Synchro. Yay! There it is. Penguin Brave. Yeah, so check it out. Penguin Brave? Yeah. Uh. No, we're not gonna play anything. Yeah, your opponent cannot target face down monsters with card effects, and. Yeah, if Synchro Summon, you can Special Summon a Penguin from your deck, face down, like Penguin Soldier. And then whenever your opponent activates a Monster Effect, Quick Effect, you can... Yeah, yeah, Penguin Soldier. Quick Effect, you can flip one face down defense position Water Monster you control, face up. Pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. Oh, he didn't have space for two. He's only going to go for one. That, uh... 
I don't know about that, but okay. Pretty cool. And so he got no penguin. So this is another kind of floodgate effect. During either player's turn, penguin effect is activated. Special summon this from your graveyard. And then, yeah. The card will be returned from the field to the hand by the effect of a penguin. It gets banished instead. So yeah, that's pretty good. All good stuff, amigo. All good stuff. All right, and down goes King of the Pharaoh Imps. Interesting that he attacked that with that instead of the Goaty card here. Yeah, that's pretty interesting, but okay. Pretty cool deck. Like I said, this is probably the coolest deck we've seen. Is it necessarily the best deck? No, but it's definitely the coolest. Definitely the coolest. Okay, how many reptiles am I going to have in my grave? Hmm, with this one gone... Let me see if I can do some cheese here. Let's limit reverse. Yeah, let's uh, revive Nauia. Let's see if we can do some cheese here. Nope. Attack mode. Activate Nauia. Mm-hmm. Take water, Lily. Do, 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 do. Oh, right, maybe I shouldn't have done this because uh, now he gets Penguin Soldier, right? Hmm. Yeah, I might have made a bad play there. Oh, no. We still got water, water a little bit, though. But these two are getting banished, though. I'm pretty sure. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Ooh, yeah, that's my bad. Hmm. Okay. I got a little greedy there. Ooh, and now we can't use Ammonite either. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> it's all good. Hmm. Ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. And there's no penguin. Yeah, I definitely could have played that better. We probably could have avoided a little more damage than we needed to. Uh, but the good part is we forced a uh, penguin soldier to use its effect. This can flip it back face down though, right? Oh, no, no. There is a penguin card though that I'm not thinking of that flips a card back face down. There's some kind of card, yeah. Hmm. Okay. And we've still got a bunch of A counters out here. Planet Pollutant Virus. Hmm. Hmm, Planet Pollutant Virus. Wow. Hmm. That's actually a pretty good draw. Hmm. The problem is... Okay, here's the problem. Well, here's what I need to do. <laughs> virus is actually good. It's actually too good. I need to get rid of as many A counters as possible on his field, actually. Let's play Water Lily. Hmm. Well, and actually, I'm not sure if this is Guard Dog or something else. I'm just gonna assume it's Guard Dog. What is that? Uh... Hmm. Hmm. Incarnation. Oh, the penguin's going down, huh? Wow. Oh, no. Wait, that's Guard Dog. Wait, why would you do that here? Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, no, that makes sense. That makes sense. Um, so we can't special summon, so let's send... I think we still want to send... 
Stealth Burster, yeah. Hmm. So we want a Stealth Burster and then go for this. Hmm. Yeah, Guard Dog is so good. Hmm. Mm hmm. Another crawler. Okay. Well, believe it or not, we might be in good shape here. Especially if he overextends and starts getting rid of some A counters. Yeah, let's set Virus here. Alright, your move. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this deck is like, this is by far the most unique deck I've seen. I kind of look forward to more, but I assume more of it's like... Obviously, this is kind of the mainline combo, but what you want after this is like stuff... Cards that flip your cards face down. Like, for example, if he had a card like Book of Moon that could flip the Penguin back face down, then he could use this Penguin Brave to, uh... You know, or he could just flip summon it. He could flip summon a Penguin Soldier and banish this. You just want to re start resetting your own flip effects at this point. Like Guard Dog. Yeah, that's pretty good. Your opponent can't special summon for the rest of the turn. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I've always felt like this card was highly overlooked. Ooh, good. Did he get rid of all of his A counters? No, but he got rid of four of them. Boral Guard Dragon. Hmm. Cannot be destroyed by card effects. Oh, rip. <laughs> okay. Uh, once we're turning, you can send one card from your spell and trap zone. Uh, okay. Oh, change it to face up defense position. Nice. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Boral Guard Dragon. I need him to get rid of these two is the main thing, though. But I think we lost, basically, either way, because this can't be destroyed by card effects, right? Like, unless he gets rid of this for some... for some, like, really dumb reason, uh... he's got this, so... Mm-hmm. And so now he can change... He has something to face up defense, so if he has like a penguin soldier, he can flip it up right now, so. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And he's just going battle phase, so, okay. Nope. Do 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 do. Interesting. That actually gives us a chance here. Uh, damage equals Reptile? Hmm. Yeah, that, believe it or not, that just gave us a slight chance. Because we're going to take 1,900 points of damage. So... Hmm. Boy, oh boy, what should I take here? I don't really think it matters, because yeah, this is only once per turn, but uh, I guess we can take... Hmm... Maybe it does matter. Let's take Venomenon. We're just going to try to survive the turn. Yeah, Venomenon. Hmm... Ah, that's probably a penguin soldier or something, huh? Crawler. Uh... After this is play, put face up, negate all... Oh. Okay. 
But my effect activates in the graveyard, you fool. Kill Venomenon. Do 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 do. Venomenon. Do 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 do. I guess we'll banish, uh. King? Yeah. Venomenon. Do 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 do. Yeah. I don't know how, how the heck we survived this. Well, I know how. He didn't attack with. If he had just attacked with World Guard Dragon first, uh, yeah. Like, there's no way we would have survived it. <laughs> the extra 600, he needed it, man. He needed it. Okay, somehow we're still alive. Um. Yeah, let's, let's revive Phenomenon again. Why not? Let's banish, uh, Ammonite from the graveyard. Normally I'd never want to do that, but, uh, defense mode of the Namana. Do, 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 do. Nice. Well, I'm proud of myself for that one. <laughs> we should not have survived that turn. Ain't no way, man. All right. Ooh! <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> oh no, he's probably gonna ash this, but I mean, how funny is this gonna be if this actually works? Alright, let's just try it. Snake Rain, go. Let's just try it. <laughs> if this works, that was one hell of a top deck, bro. Um, wow, what do I even want to send to the graveyard here? Uh, let's send King. Let's send um you. Let's send Nauya. And I guess let's send Sinister Serpent. Ain't no way. <laughs> uh, uh, Stealth Burster go. I guess we'll place it on. Well, this can't be destroyed by card effects anyway. Uh, let's place some counters on this crawler. For whatever reason. Can this be destroyed by battle? Uh, oh wait, it's quick effect, huh? Oh yeah, he can change me to defense mode regardless. Hmm, I didn't think about that. Okay. Either way, it's pretty funny that we got Snake right now. We may be able to survive like a longer amount of time. Oh yeah, we can pop something once. Well. Let's definitely pop, uh... Yeah, let's pop... Probably this, huh? Now, nah, let's get the penguin out. Sorry, penguin. Yeah. Okay. And... It'd actually be dumb of me to go to attack mode because... Well, let's see if I, we can trick him here. Let's see if we can trick him. Because, honestly, if he uses his uh, quick effect, then that's on him. Mm-hmm. Let's attack Subterra Behemoth. If he's smart, he won't... Oh. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. You just you just helped me not to die. <laughs> All right, and my turn. Like, okay, see, the smart move there, just let me, you know, destroy this in attack mode. All you need is uh, 400 points, so just, you know, attack with Borogar Drain and you're good. Like, that was that was pretty dumb. That was pretty dumb of him. I mean, I'm sure he's got some other cards to out Venomenon here, but... Yeah, that wasn't too bright, man. That wasn't too bright. <laughs> uh... Ah, okay, there you go. Penguin Ninja! Nice. Oh, so he's gonna bounce our... Please bounce my limit reverse. I wouldn't mind that one bit. Alright, and we were bluffing with a virus anyway, so... Not a big deal. Oh! Well, that's game. He had Penguin Soldier down the whole time. <laughs> I like this deck, though. Yeah, Penguin Soldier is cool, man. Very cool. Alright. 
That's a pretty cool way to end stream, though, honestly. Very unique penguin deck. It's like... In fact, that's probably my first time ever seeing that deck, ever. So... Alright, well... There we go. Alrighty. Well, let's see if we have any other rewards. And I will end the stream here. Do 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 do. <laughs> Man, that the combo he did to get uh, cause like I've, you know I've a, uh, like I know Great Emperor Penguin's good, you know because you get two from the deck, but he special summoned it twice in the same turn, and it, like that card's not. I never knew that card's not a once per turn. That it almost makes me want to like. I wish we could like look at that guy's deck, cause that's one I definitely. I would try to build that deck, just because Penguin Soldier is my favorite. And like, he got it to where, you know, he could loop it, loop Great Emperor Penguin too, and that's like, that's really awesome, so. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna do it for me. I uh, appreciate you guys checking it out, and uh, yeah, if you're watching this on YouTube, I appreciate it as well. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, have a good night. And if you're watching on Twitch, yeah, have a good rest of your day, and I'll see you guys all Next time, it's Flood Mod 14. Signing out. Bye bye. All right. <laughs> oh, what a fun deck, man. Penguins. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Where is the stop button here? Do, 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 I think it's like right here. Yeah, there we go. Uh,